Need some coins for that God Squad you've always wanted? Check out rockbottomcoins.com for your one-stop shop of buying or selling coins and solo grinding services. Use code ZERK at checkout for 10% off your order. The whole thing wobbing. What's going on guys? It's Xerxes coming at you today with another YouTube video and today I'm going to be doing a lineup update video but before we do that we are going to be picking out the new John Madden to get that plus one speed boost to the entire team and I'll show you guys that as well but I will be doing a 50,000 subscriber Q&A so if you guys have Twitter what I want you to do is log on to Twitter type of any question you want just make sure when you do it that you have the hashtag zerk 50k it should pop up on the screen right now uh, showing you guys exactly how to do it now you can also post it down in the comment section below but i might not remember to come back to this exact video and check the comment section so the best way to ensure that i do see your question for the q a is going to be going on twitter hashtag zerk 50 Okay, so thank you guys very much. We're closing in on 50,000 subscribers. So if you guys are not subbed to the channel, make sure you guys hit that sub button and smack the like button down below. Now, if you're wondering about the primetime performers, why that video is not out yet, it's because it's delayed. I don't know why. Maybe they're changing the players. It was supposed to be Gordon. Uh, it was supposed to be Jordan Howard and then number 23 for the Packers. I don't know who number 23 is. Uh, it could be Micah Hyde. It could be... Uh, Casey Hayward, maybe? I'm honestly not too sure. I didn't look into it. I just know it was number 23 defensive back for the Packers. But, on to the Series 3, and we're going to go ahead and pick up Coach Madden. So, I actually did actually play uh, Mud Draft last night. I got 6 wins, so I'm going to be having those rewards and also my weekly rewards coming out for you guys once they do actually drop this. And this took quite a while to get done. So, 100 Series tokens. We finally got Series 3 Coach Madden. And of course, you can quick sell for 900 training. Definitely worth it to do that. <laughs> but we're going to go ahead and add him into Madden, and I'll show you guys the upgrades. So we're going to go ahead and add this collectible on. Now, it does cost quite a bit of training, I got to say, to actually get the speed boost. But take a look here. You can get passing, rushing, pass defense, rush defense, or physical. Now, of course, physical costs 5,000, but obviously it's worth it. You literally get plus one speed. Oh, wait, actually, it's jumping too. I did not know about the jumping. I just knew about the speed. So I could go with something else like the passing again and give, you know, another spec catch, another medium accuracy, deep accuracy. But when you have plus one speed, you take the freaking plus one speed. So now my entire team is going to be a plus one speed to them. And now let's get into the lineup update and I cannot wait to see my cards. Now with that plus one speed, Donovan McNabb has 87 speed, which is definitely pretty nice. I also do have the Madden passing chem, uh, but I do have Donovan McNabb at QB for now. Personally, I think he's okay. Really, he's missed quite a bit of throws as of recently, though. So that's really this close to pushing me over the edge with some of the throws he's been missing. He can't even hit a high, the high point fade anymore. So it's really been bad. Uh, I might... Go ahead and pick up a new quarterback pretty soon. I'm really just waiting for the Christmas promo because I feel like we're going to get some type of amazing QB. Uh, and then, of course, after the Super Bowl, we're probably going to get Ultimate Legends like the week after. And, of course, Michael Vick. So, I honestly might just go ahead and pick up Mike Vick Legend right now, power him up, and just wait for the Ultimate Legend because, honestly, that card's going to be so good. You can use that card all year long. But Donovan McNabb is my quarterback, at least for the time being. Now, I do have Sprinter Tier 1 on both Ricky and Zeke, but now Zeke has 95 speed with John Madden. So this card, this Zeke card is freaking disgusting. Take a look at the stats, 95 speed, 92 excel, 95 agility, 96 carrying, 71 catch with a 91 elusiveness. Don't be fooled by the 79 trucking. He has trucked some people over. And also a 92 break tackle with an 81 strength. Now, on December 14th, uh, we're going to be getting the next series update, which can be Series 4. And I'm almost positive we're going to be getting some new level updates to Ricky Williams. And uh, we're also going to get some new levels in general. So, I feel like I probably won't use Zeke in about two weeks. When Ricky gets his upgrades and then Ricky goes up, Ricky will probably be better. And then I'll be rocking out again with Ricky Williams and my running back one until Zeke gets another upgrade. But for the meantime, for the next two weekend leagues, I'm definitely rocking out with Zeke. Now, because of that plus one speed boost, Calvin Johnson is actually now a 95 overall card. But I do also have Sprinter on Jerry Rice and Randy Moss. I don't have Sprinter on Calvin Johnson because honestly, I don't think I'll be keeping him all year long. 
Uh, he doesn't have a power up, which I kind of don't like, so I'd have to pick up a new Calvin Johnson if he comes out anyways. But I am going to be getting the new Tyree kill tomorrow with training points uh, because of the Blitz promo, which I'll probably make a video either later tonight or tomorrow showing you guys actually how to buy players with training. Uh, I know that some of you guys actually don't know how to do that. I've seen some comments, seen some people on Twitter ask me, hey, make a video on it. So... I got you guys. I have that video up pretty soon. But wide receiver core is pretty stacked. We do have Calvin Johnson, Jerry Rice, Randy Moss. We also have Tyreek Hill, which will be powered up tomorrow. Uh, Michael Thomas, Terrell Owens is literally just sitting there. And look at all the chems that it says he has because it's just glitched out. Goes all the way down the line. He glitched out on everybody. But this is the wide receiver core. I, I like it a lot. Uh, I really just want Randy Moss to get a new upgrade. Now, coming down the offensive line, we have left tackle Jason Peters, Steve Hutchison, which we will be getting that new uh, Quentin Nelson football outsider with the rookie premiere. So, I honestly might just sell Steve Hutchison and keep the rookie premiere. Save a little bit of coins there. Travis Frederick, Larry Allen, Lane Johnson. We also have James Levin at fullback. Then at tight ends, we have Greg Olson, Jimmy Graham, and Zach Ertz. Now, taking a look at the linebacker core, this is one of my favorite parts of my team, definitely. So, right outside linebacker. Lawrence freaking Taylor, 92 speed, 94 excel, 94 strength, 93 tackle with a 99 power move and a 96 finesse move. He also has 91 play right. The card is ridiculous. Then my middle linebackers or my users, Ryan Chazier and Deion Jones. Now, honestly, I have not like really been using Kevin Green with the way that I've been running my defense. I kind of have Lawrence Taylor and then my three D linemen on the D line. And then Kevin Green really has just not been playing at all. So, Kevin Green really doesn't play anymore for me. If there's like a new left side linebacker that comes out that I really like, I'll probably start running a bit of a different, uh, different defense to get Kevin Green more involved. But for now, I like how my team is. Now getting on to the defensive line at right end, we do have Aaron Donald with 81 speed, 87 excel, 93 strength, 91 tackling, 89 block shit, and a 97 power move. At defensive tackle, we have Mean Joe Green and Jared McCoy. Now, I do run a 3-4, so McCoy really doesn't play. I just have him there because I got him his NAT. Figured I'd just keep him there for the chem boost and also just to keep him there. Uh, he also, by the way, guys, if you see like a gem on players that aren't supposed to have it, it's just a glitch. It just shows like that in the lineup sometimes. Uh, Khalil Mack at left end, of course. He has 91 blocks and 93 power move, 84 speed. And then we also have... Uh, Devon Godchow, I want to say, is how you say his name. Maybe it's David Godchow. Uh, but he has pass rush time six on him. He doesn't have the gym or the out of the way chem. But he does have pass rush time six just to give me that pass rush tier five that I finally needed. And now we're getting into the most stacked part of my team. Now, without a doubt, my secondary is stacked. So quarterback one, we do have Patrick Peterson, who has 98 man, 95 zone, 92 speed. And then we have Deion Sanders, who now with Sprinter and John Madden has 98 speed. So that's freaking insane. Uh, he also has 96 Excel, 96 Agility, 97 Play Rank, 96 Zone, 96 Man Coverage. Cornerback 5 is actually Jalen Ramsey. Yes, cornerback 5. The only reason I don't sell him is because of the fact that, well, it's Jalen Ramsey. <laughs> Even though he doesn't really play for me that much, once he gets a new upgrade, he'll be boosting into the starting spot somewhere. Uh, Darius Slay is actually cornerback three right now with 92 speed and 91 acceleration. And then Marshawn Lattimore is cornerback four. <laughs> so it's a pretty stacked lineup. Now, at same things, we do have Adrian Amos, who, in my opinion, is an absolute stud. Great zone coverage, great speed, great hit power. And then we also have Paul Krause at free safety. And backup strong safety is Derwin James. So this is the team that I have, guys. Honestly, I like it a lot. I don't really think I'm making any upgrades anytime soon, uh, except for getting Tyreek Hill, a wide receiver, or maybe Travis Kelsey uh, at tight end. I'll have to look into that. But also, if you guys are wondering about the special teams, I do have Robbie Gold and Michael Dixon. Maybe I'll pick up a new punter and kicker pretty soon as well. Uh, Dion and Tyreek Hill, of course, at kick returner. Uh, specialist, that's what it's looking like. Obviously, I want to have Zeke in there, so I put him at power halfback and also third down running back. Uh, you guys see the playbook, Saints offense, and Bears defense. But I hope that you guys did enjoy the video. And if you did, smack the like button, subscribe, and comment. Once again, guys, rookie, uh, the um, primetime performers are delayed for some reason. So sadly, I'm not going to have that. In four. It looks like we have a month elite giveaway right here. Uh, let's see what we're going to get with this. Sean Taylor. Okay. I'm just going to leave it at that. I'm not going to say anything about that because last time I did, sadly, uh, it didn't end up coming true with the Barry Sanders. But Sean Taylor, 
I'll leave it at that. But you guys see, I do have these packs ready for you guys once the primetime performers do actually drop. So if you guys enjoyed the video, and if you did, smack the like button, subscribe and comment once again. Hashtag Zert50K on Twitter. Make sure you guys send me some questions for the Q&A. Hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys next time.